by his power divine i'm saved through new life sublime life now is sweet and my joy is complete for i'm saved 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 by his power divine i'm saved through new life sublime life now is sweet and my joy is complete for i'm saved 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 by his power divine i'm saved through new life sublime life now is sweet and my joy is complete for i'm saved 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 i remember that um that song crossed my mind just now i have not heard that song or sung that song in years 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 and it just made me think of how we can have um, adversity, you know, in our life. Are we faced with some things that, you know, can be tra can be qualified as traumatic revelations? And I, uh, I've shared some of my story with you all on my um, morning walk and chit chat videos. So it's like based off of that, cause I'm not gonna go all through it right now, but based off of that, it just made me look back, you know, on my childhood. I actually, it didn't so much make me look back on my childhood. It just kind of came to me, that song came to me. I remember my um, pastor, uh, he would sing that song. He was a bishop and he was a pastor of my church. <clears throat> And when our jurisdiction, you know, would uh, have our annual meeting, he would sing that song and fill up that theater because it was like, I think over 50 churches in my jurisdiction from throughout the state, but like three jurisdictions at the time. And he would get up and sing that song. That was one of his favorite songs and fill up that uh, theater, all the uh, uh, quote unquote saints, you know, in the church, be there singing that song, just bellowing it out and despite some of the realizations that I have come to about my life in terms of, uh, you know, uh, how I was raised, not so much how I was raised, but, you know, who raised me and all of that. It's just, I had some really, really, a really, really awesome upbringing in the light you know, in the dark and the shadows, uh, that has nothing to do with me. You know, that was that though those are things that other people have to deal with. Uh, but in the light, I had a wonderful upbringing, and that was just one of the. I don't know. That song just came to me, just out of the blue, like wow, and it was just like uh, just showed me like all the beautiful uh, memories I have of growing up in a place and space that. Sometimes I say, like, I was never supposed to be here. I was never supposed to be there. I was supposed to be, you know, somewhere else. But I don't know. Maybe I was supposed to be right where I was. You know what I'm saying? I think about what my life could have been like had I been in uh, the place where I feel like I was supposed to be. And I grieved that. I grieved that for a while. But, like, during my um, quiet time, one day this week, it just kind of hit me like I had a, a great upbringing. I had a wonderful upbringing. I had a wonderful upbringing. One of the greatest memories for me was growing up in church. I hated going to church often, you know, because it was boring. But then there were times that it was I mean, we had a good time. <laughs> I, I did. I had a, a wonderful time. It was just an intricate part of my life. You know, it was just equated to my life. 
and um, and some wonderful memories, wonderful people, flawed people. Everybody is flawed, you know. So some of the things that I feel <clears throat> might have occurred or uh, question, you know, coming to find out these things out about myself made me question, you know, what was that really? What what was that all about? And in this process of uh, self-discovery, that was one thing that I came, have come to peace with, my upbringing. And um, it was wonderful. It was it was really wonderful. And now that, that was a great memory that I had. You know, life now is sweet and my joy is complete. For I'm saved, saved, saved. And you can put whatever a connotation you want. Of course, that was a, a, a hymn out of the Christian church. But you can put whatever connotation you want to it. Life now is sweet and my joy is complete. For I'm saved, saved, saved. Yeah. There's always going to be the negative with the positive. There's always going to be the, be the yin and the yang. Opposite, yet complementary. They both must be. So anyway, I just want to share that. <laughs> Y'all be blessed. Peace.